Okay, what if we told you that there was a sport that could only be played if you deflate the ball? Not some cheap Tom Brady joke. This is apparently a real sport growing in popularity, especially here. Steve Overmeyer is here to tell us about this one. Steve. Yeah, you know, and we're not excluding Tom Brady. He could totally play sure. this sport, absolutely. And in fact, it would be good for the young and old alike. It doesn't take long for a sport to become relevant when the time is right. For more than a century, paddle tennis has been a sport, but now it's called pop tennis. Who plays this sport at the highest level? Well, we went to Peter Cooper Village in the city championships to find out. My name is Jordan Murray. I'm a private equity attorney here in New York City, and I love playing pop tennis. You play with a deflated tennis ball. It's as easy as sticking a pin in a ball. It takes some of the bounce out of the ball. Frankly, the court's just too small to play with that live of the ball. This is the New York City Pop Tennis Championships. Jordan is the defending champion and number one seed. Pop tennis is a very different game from tennis. But as you'll see, the court's far smaller. The net's a little bit lower. We play with a paddle rather than a tennis racket. When you first come out here, very first time, you feel how different it is. I actually described it as playing ping pong, standing on the ping pong table. It's a busy day for Jordan. He'll need to win three matches just to get back to the final. Easy score, but some good points, and it was way we like it. Now on to the semi? On to the semi. Stuff. He makes it to the championship again. Advice comes from all sides. He's aggressive. He's a fighter. He's on the attack a lot. Which is what? You got to play. You know, you got to always be, be charging. Brian's great. He's really a great player. He hits the ball with tremendous. Brian called. Heads. Heads it is. Game, set, match, championship. Thank you very much. Jordan finished as the New York City pop tennis runner-up. Of course I'll play with you. But to his son, he's a champion. This is a sport that was just rebranded three months ago. It's already drawing interest from sponsors, which could lead to prize money and then maybe a professional tour. Maurice Christine, the man behind this, is uh, the famous uh, Los Angeles agent, Kenny Lidner, who says that his ultimate goal is to turn this into an Olympic sport. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow, I thought you were going to say U.S. A, Open yeah, or something. Quite ambitious, right? Yes. It would be outstanding. It's like a heck of a good workout, though. It, right? Absolutely. No matter. Is it more challenging to hit the ball? Is that what I it think is? that's the key. The fact that the ball is deflated yeah. means that you can't you put as much power. spin on it. You're yeah. going to need to put a little more power. So the equipment changes it, and it makes it, um, you know, certainly a fun game to play. The crowd was going nuts. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Steve. Sure. All right.